Good morning. So today, today we're going to discuss in this video. I'm going to discuss PFR uh, simulation in Aspen Heinsis. So let me share the PowerPoint. So, ang topic na for this video is isomerization in a PFR with Aspen Hysis. Okay, so this is the reaction that we're going to simulate in Aspen Hysis, cis-2-butin to trans-2-butin. Tapos, here are the basic uh, reaction kinetic equation. RA is equals to KCA. And then DCADT is equals to negative RA. So therefore, DCADT is equals to negative KCA. <clears throat> so if you still remember, pag, pag PFR, kamukha rin lang siya ng BATS. Tapos sa BATS naman, i-integrate nyo lamang itong last equation. Magkakaroon na, na kayo ng ano, time versus concentration equation. So ang ginagawa lang pag PFR, yung time, ginagawa lang residence time. Tapos pag nakalculate nyo na yung time, uh, in the in the wanted conversion, yung time na yun ay equal dun sa residence time. Tapos yung residence time ay volume over flow rate. So pag alam nyo yung flow rate, volumetric flow rate, makakalculate nyo yung volume ng reactor. Pag spe specified ang diameter ng reactor, ng PFR, you can, you can calculate the length of the uh, PFR reactor. So yun lang Okay, so review pa rin ng kinetics. R sub A is uh, moles of reactant becoming product per unit time, per volume. Okay. And then, yun nga, sinasabi ko sa inyo kanina, no? yung time until any given conversion of reactant is independent of reactor size. <laughs> Okay, so whether CSTR yan or PFR or BATS reactor, yung time para, para sa isang given conversion ay, ay independent of the reactor size. So ang ginagawa lang natin pag PFR at saka pag CSTR, kinoconvert lang natin yung time sa residence time. Residence time is volume over volumetric flow rate. So we'll be able to calculate the volume of the reactor. Okay? So pag PFR, ina-assume natin na uh, perfect yung radial mixing. Pag radial mixing along the along, along the radius, ano? Fully mix siya. Tapos no actual mixing. Okay? No actual mixing. <clears throat> so ibig sabihin the flow is laminar. So, position down tube Z is analog for time. <laughs> yung, yung say dito is the length. Ano? This is, as, as you can see, this is the length of the pipe. So, <clears throat> as the reactant moves, yung concentration ng reactant, generally, nagdi-decrease siya. Ano? Along the length of the tube. Okay? So... Yeah, basically, this is dz dt is equals to b. This is the linear speed. And then, pag in-isolate nyo dito yung dt, dt is equals to dz over db. So, yun, ito pa rin yung isang another, another equation. Ano? dz dt is equals to b dz dc 
is equal to negative KCA. So this, this form, uh, this is the linear speed no? nung, nung flow. You can, you can calculate the, the length of the pipe <coughs> using this equation. O, oh, pwede rin. Kaya Pagler kasi ang ginagawa natin is we derive the, ano, no? we, we try to find the residence time ng PFR. Tapos pag may residence time na tayo, kung alam natin yung flow rate, uh, there, there, makakalculate na natin yung volume. Tapos volume, uh, alam naman natin yung volume ng pipe, makakalculate na natin yung length. Ganun din, ano? Hindi, hindi tayo masyadong familiar dito. Pero sound naman yung derivation niya. Okay, so ito yung isa-simulate natin sa Aspen High Seas. Okay. Uh, use Aspen High Seas to calculate the reactor length required to achieve 90% of reactor conversion. Tapos, assume steady state operation. A single tube reactor with a diameter of 2 inches. Okay, so given yung kanyang diameter. Tapos assume a feed stream of 100% cis butene with a flow rate of 1 kilo, kilo mole per hour at 10 bar and 25 degrees Celsius and K is equals to 0.23 per minute. So let me share, let me share my Aspen analysis. <clears throat> Okay, so first step is open a new case. Okay, next add some, ano, add some, add the, ano, the components. So, <clears throat> medyo challenging hanapin yung cis-tubutin at saka trans-tubutin. So, ginagawa ko ay transfer to simulation name. So, I type cis 2 butene Yung, ito nyo, lumabas na siya, ano? Let's add this, cis 2 butene Tapos trans, I think trans is TR2 butene. Ayan. Let's add ulit. Okay. So these are, these are your components, ano? Tapos ano, this, we're going to add the fluid package. So for, for this particular Tutorial, we're going to use NRTL. Okay. So, RK. Ito lang natin sa RK para mas ano, accurate. <clears throat> okay, and then kasi may reaction tayo, we're, we're going to add the reaction. So, add the reaction. Click add. Okay, then another add. Add reaction. Tapos, kinetic. Tapos, another add reaction. So you can you can close this. Tapos double click reaction one. Okay, our components are cis two butene at chaka trans two butene. <clears throat> Since ang cis two butene reactant, ang kanyang stoichiometric coefficient ay negative one. Ang kanyang ang trans two butene product so positive one. So Itong forward order at reverse order, babaguhin nyo ito depende dun sa ano, ano? dun sa given na information. So, ang given na information sa atin, first order siya sa cis butene So, tama ito. Ano? Tapos, uh, zero order siya sa trans butene So, tama itong information na ito. Sa reverse order naman, okay lang yan. Di nyo babaguhin. Basta, huwag empty nyo lamang yung sa ano, yung data ng A. No? yung data ng A sa reverse reaction. Ito, uh, this is 0.23 per minute. Ito, type natin po our concentration, liquid phase, cis-tubutin, tama yan, ano? Tapos kasi per minute siya, ang per minute lang na nag-iisa sa rate unit ay yung pound mole per foot per minute. So kaya ito, pound mole per foot din. Foot cube. Tapos ito ay 0.23. Yan. Lagay niyo yung E ay 0. Walang information, 0 lang yung E. Yung activation energy. Ano? So makikita nyo, converse na reaction. Ano? 
So, pag conversion reaction, may green na. Ito, ready na. You can close this. Tapos, add to FT. Add to fluid package. Ano? Another, add set to fluid package. So, maka-add na siya. So, mawawala na exclamation point dito. So, you're, you're now ready to go to the simulation part. Enter simulation part. Tapos, mag-drag tayo ng PFR. Ito ng PFR. Ito yung PFR, ano? Pag pinapat nyo naman dyan, lalabas yun. Plug flow reactor. Drag nyo dito sa gitna. Click sa white area. No? Click in the white area. Tapos, double click nyo lang dito para mapasok natin yung mga data natin. So, unang-una, papasok natin is sa worksheet. Pasok natin yung composition. <coughs> Hindi. Ano ba naman? Design. Design muna tayo. Connections. So, connections, para hindi na kayo mapagod, I suggest, ano na lang, mga one. One na lang yung gamitin yung pangalan ng stream. One. Tapos yung product, two. Para hindi na rin kayo nag-iisip. No? Ano na lang. Tapos punta na sa worksheet. So, pwede nyo na ipasok yung yung feed. Pure, ano siya, no? Pure, uh, pure cis-tubutin. Tapos yung trans-tubutin ay uh, wala, ano? So, ito yung mole fraction nila, ano? Okay lang. Tapos, uh, pasok natin yung given na, ano? Temperature, 25 degrees Celsius. <clears throat> Pressure, 10 bar. Tapos, kilogram mole per hour, 1. So, as you can see, nag-convert sa yung feed, ano natin, ano? Yung ating feed stream. <clears throat> okay, so, sunod, uh, we go to reaction, and then we add our reaction. You click reaction, and then you add the reaction. That's set 1. Okay. Tapos, click design. Then you click parameters. So, sa parameters, uh, given, ano, yung pressure drop ay zero. Okay. Tapos, sa rating. So, given na yung diameter ay 2 inches. So, intern nyo lang 2 inches. Ayan. Tapos, uh, kamukha sa ano, kamukha sa CSTR. Kung sa CSTR nagsisimula tayo sa 5 liters, Sa PFR naman, nagsisimula tayo sa 1 meter. No? Yung kanyang length, 1 meter. So, as you can see, pagpasok nyo ng 1 meter, nag-converge na yung reactor. Kaya lang, no, kita nyo, pag chinect nyo, oh, yan, no? meron, na, meron na kayong mga concentration. Converge na siya. Kaya lang, ang gusto natin, 90% yung conversion. So, pag chinect nyo to, parang mga 20... 20, ano lang, 26%, no? 26% lang. So, mababa. <clears throat> Yan, 26.12 lang yung conversion natin. So, mababa pa. Gusto natin 90%. So, para makalculate natin yung tamang volume, gagamit tayo ng adjust function. So, i-adjust, palalakay natin yung volume or pahabain natin yung reactor and then hanggang yung conversion maging 90%. No? Yun yung target natin, 90% conversion. So, mag add lang kayo ng adjust function. Tapos, double click. Tapos, uh, ito, PFR 100. <clears throat> I-adjust natin yung length. Tube length. Select. <clears throat> Tapos, ito. Uh, PFR 100 ulit. Tapos, yun. Actual percent conversion. Double click to. Tapos isa pang click doon. Ano? Tapos select. Tapos to lagay nyo 90. Okay. So, enter. Ah, ito. Parameters para hindi siya pa ulit-ulit. Lagay nyo ito ng 1,000. 1,000 times siya mag i -tray. Ano? And then, just press start. So, nag-converge na siya. Ano? And then, you can check. You can check that the... You can check the length of the reactor. Go to rating. And then, yun. 8.347 meters. Okay? We can check that this is similar dun sa tutorial. 
Let's check yung tutorial. Mm -hmm. 8.3 for the 8 meters din. Ano? So, ay, teka. Hindi nyo pala kita. Stop share ko yung ano ko. Tapos, pakita ko sa inyo yung tutorial. Ito ata. 8.348 meters din sa tutorial. Okay, so, practice, practice lang. Madali lang naman. Ano? So, ang, ang ano natin, ang midterm natin, uh, shortcut distillation, rigorous distillation, CSTR, at saka PFR. So, sa ano yan ha? Sa Thursday, 1 to 4 p.m. Okay? So, see you sa Thursday.